Yes, that's Robin Williams in the robot suit. It weighs 35 pounds and is full of wires, by the way. Bicentennial Man's the movie. It's the story of a robot's 200-year life. It's no dummy robot. It's Robin Williams the robot. The real-life Robin Williams, well, he's anything but a mechanical man. But on second thought, this guy can't be human. We now turn to the Book of Williams. Page 29. Thank you, friends. If you look in your book of Williams right now, Williams, Harry Tom. Williams once wore nothing under his trench coat and flashed other comics. Not true. I did once flash Miss Pam Dauber on an episode of Mork and Mindy as I walked up the stairs. Williams once said something bizarre to Frank Sinatra when he met him. So happy to meet you, sir. I could drop a log. <laughs> You really said that to yes. the chairman of the board. Yes, to the chairman of the board, and luckily, Julie wasn't in the room. And the Book of Williams, finally, page 49. And you made fun of Michael Jackson, I bet, in his oxygen tank. You once had a sensory deprivation tank. Yes. According to this, where you would float in darkness and silence in 90-degree salt water. Yes. This I, is true. Very much so. I did that for, uh, during the lovely days of recuperation. <laughs> It was necessary after attending the Columbian College Fund. Well, have you done anything else as odd? That's pretty unusual. I haven't heard anybody get in their tank and they get shriveled up there. Yeah, you get tri shriveled up there. <laughs> yes. Oh, look. <laughs> Here we go again. No. No, no, I'm starting to open oh, no, it. It's no, Robin. It's Robin. Big Daddy. <laughs> oh, the room gets hotter. It was just as a recovery device. It's they different. say that in there was mm -hmm. the essence of Robin all the time. I read that. I thought it sounds good anyway. The essence of Robin. Inside the robot? was always in the robot. Yeah, I think it were. Uh, that's why I was you know, in there, <laughs> in the camp as it was, uh, to basically try and find something unique in how the robot moves, how it talks, how it looks at people. Now, Miss Doubtfire was probably uncomfortable at times to be her, yes. physically. Yeah. This tops the cake? Yeah, that? this is it. This is way beyond bondage. Two cannibals are eating a clown. One turns to the other and says, does this taste funny to you? How do you make a hanky dance? Put a little boogie in it. What is a brunette between two blondes? Translator. Do you know why blind people don't like to skydive? It scares their dogs. A man with dementia is driving on the freeway. His wife calls him on the mobile phone and says, sweetheart, I heard there's someone driving the wrong way in the freeway. He says, one, there's hundreds. What do people uh, on the street know they stop you at the airport? What character are they going for now? I mean, is Mort gone? Well, no, it comes back. It comes back even like you'll meet... <laughs> Here's the thing, sometimes you'll meet extraordinary people. I, like, I met a very famous jazz pianist, and his first line was, Mort! I was like, oh, God. <laughs> But it's, it's because it's in people's memory banks from watching television, you know, from... You had to do Nanu Nanu in a while, though, probably. Have or you, you get different variations of it. Diddy, Diddy, Zuby, Zuby, you know. <laughs> Mork and Cindy. What was that girl's name? Pandy? What's her name? You know, and you get variations on that. But, yeah, you still get it. Did you think you'd ever get past Mrs. Doubtfuck? I think that was such a character that people remembered so much. Yeah, I think uh, there's still... Little children want that. And, you know, if you visit in hospitals and stuff, little kids will recognize that more than anything. They'll say, this is Mrs. Doubtfire, and they'll look at me, and then I'll go, hello, dear, and then they'll go, you're him, but you're not him. Hey, Robin, what do you want for Christmas? For Christmas? <laughs> what have First you asked all, Mommy I, for? I'll have to fix my teeth. <laughs> what if I... I actually have asked Mommy for something very special. <laughs> and Mommy knows what it is. <laughs> Why does that sound so bad? You know? <laughs> not my mom, you know. Oh, it's not yes. like Oedipus, so I'll be wandering around blind in New yes. York, but... The wife. Yes, the wife. Is it a video game or something like that? Something like that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I know we... So you play with Spielberg a lot, too, and... We play, uh, yeah, uh, we, uh, online. Online. Mm -hmm. We have uh, different uh, games. Maybe we... Stephen will come over sometime and play with you in person. I hope so. Phone <laughs> <laughs> home, Stephen. Friend, phone, good.